This is the Uptick Newswire Stock Day Podcast, sponsored by InvestorsHangout.com. Subscribe to us on iTunes, Google Play, and YouTube to stay up to date on penny stock news and interviews, public information on OTC, pink sheets, and microcap stocks from around the world. With your host, Connie Colella. Hello, I'm Connie Colella here in the Uptick Newswire studio with Everett Jolly, the founder and CEO of Uptick Newswire. Thanks for joining us today. It's a pleasure to be here, Connie. Everett, this is a very exciting time for you and all of us here at Uptick Newswire as we launch this new video show. Can you tell all of us why you decided to create this show? Well, as you know, Connie, we uh, did the audio interviews uh, for about two and a half years, and we did over a thousand interviews in two and a half years. And I thought the next level to take this to is actually put together a news network where the CEOs can come into the studio, you interview them, them actually get their story out and, and actually investors can look at their face and say, hey, I, I like this CEO or I don't like this CEO or I got some questions for him. So I thought it was time to take it to the next level. Okay. So why is it so important to spotlight these CEOs in the micro cap space? I'm all about the underdog. I'm an underdog myself. And so when you have 10,000 companies on the OTC markets, yes, a majority of those are not going to go anywhere. But my team has discovered 500 to 1,000 of those companies that have real revenues, real products, and they are going to move up from the OTCQB to the QX and then to the NASDAQ. And we want to uh, bring a light on those companies. There's no, let, let's face it, there's none of these companies getting invited on Fox News, CNBC. So where is their outlet? I hope it's up Tick Newswire. Are there a few companies in particular that you'd like to point out? Well, you know, uh, we started the show back in 2016, that being the podcast. And on there, we discovered a lot of companies that were trading between one cents and 10 cents. One was RXMD. We found that at one cent, it got as high as 26 cents. You know, uh, another one was EVIO. We spotted that one at six cents. It's over a dollar a share. Uh, LXRP, eight cents, over a dollar a share. So there's, you know, there's quite a few companies that have come on our show that have started at pennies and went to, you know, close to a dollar. And then after the video show is completed here on the set, where will the videos be posted? Well, that's a great question. You know, anybody can actually go into their office and shoot a video. But it's that taking that content and put it on the great platforms where tens of thousands of people are going to see that is a whole different ball game. So we got a call almost a year ago from the NASDAQ and said, Everett, we love what you're doing on the OTC markets. We want to be a part of that. And so we signed a contract with the uh, NASDAQ. And so now we can take our videos and put them on some of the biggest news sites in the world. We're talking about Seeking Alpha. Uh, we're talking about Bloomberg, The Wall Street Journal, Market Watch, and quite a few more. That's pretty exciting it stuff. It is. All right, let's delve a little bit deeper into Uptick Newswire. Why did you start the company? Well, I started the company because I'm an underdog myself, and I just got my heart goes out for the underdog. I'm always rooting for the underdog, and there's a lot of great companies out there on the uh, TSX Venture in Canada and in the OTC market that get no love, that have real revenues, have a real product, but don't want to see in their story. They're not getting their story out, and so... I, back in uh, May of 13th, uh, 2013, I decided to put together a network that would underserve or, or serve the under, underserved companies out there that have no platform to get their message out to. And so that's why I started up Tick Newswire. And how does your company make money? We make money on about two or three different facets. Uh, one, we write the press releases. So we charge them to write a press release. Two, we do a corporate communications. There's 526 uh, investor relation companies on the OTC. We're one of them. And we are the only uh, company out there that has 50,000 Twitter followers. We have a social media department. Uh, we charge them for corporate communications. They get their story out. Uh, we have over 121,000 listeners on Audio Boom that's listened to our, uh, our podcast. So that's how we make our money. And who do you compete with? Well, we I don't know if we actually compete with anybody, but there's a couple of companies out there that I do respect, that uh, Red Chip, um, Oracle Dispatch, uh, Newswire.net. Uh, um, so those are some of the companies that you know have been around a little bit. And I think that my vision for Uptick Newswire is to be a mini Bloomberg, but be for, just for the uh, uh, OTC market, 
And also we're concentrated on the ASX, the Australian Stock Exchange, and 30% of our business revenue actually comes from the TSX Venture, the Toronto Exchange uh, Stock Exchange. So, uh, you know, we're really kind of diversified in a lot of different markets. And where do you see Uptick Newswire five to 10 years from now? Well, I think we got a great vision here. We got a great team that puts it all together, makes me look really well. First of all, I think we're going to be a mini Bloomberg on many facets. Uh, we're going we're gonna to tackle the uh, ASX, the Australian Stock Exchange. We're going to tackle some third world countries uh, with their exchanges. We're 30% of our revenues currently right now come from the TSX, Toronto Stock Exchange. And we're going to build a newsroom that we're going to gather news and, and make that uh, available to people who want to invest in penny stocks. You know, you don't need tens of thousands of dollars to get wealthy. You know, I, I got a book out there, uh, How to Make Money in Nano Stocks, uh, turn $5,000 into 100000 I want to go on tour and, and, and teach my model to just the average person who says, hey, I want to get involved in penny stocks. I appreciate your time today, Everett. Thanks so much for being with us. It was my pleasure. Thanks, Connie. Well, if you are interested in joining me, Connie Colella, as a guest on our video show, please contact us at upticknewswire.com. We'd love to promote your company. We'll see you soon. This program is entirely sponsored and produced by Uptick Newswire, LLC, which is responsible for the content. The opinions and information provided on this program are those of the guests and those of the respective companies they represent and do not necessarily reflect those of the staff or management of Uptick Newswire. Uptick Newswire encourages all listeners of this program to do their due diligence and research when determining investment strategies that will work for them or to seek the assistance of an investment professional. The guests of this program may have paid for its distribution and are not directly affiliated with Uptick Newswire or the station.